Hey guys, Vegas Romaniac. I got my plastics for my WR450F. Uh, these are the uh, um, a service uh, plastics, and um, what I read online is that the manufacturer says they are compatible with the WR, um, the model and the year that was initially released under. But people that bought it from Amazon uh, complain about the fact that the holes don't fit, they need to be pre drilled blah 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 so uh, had fairly bad reviews like three stars out of five I think and um, I'm gonna put a link in the video description for this particular uh, bag for this particular uh, set uh, got him for a hundred dollars free shipping to your house um, this is the box that comes in big box with the bag in it and uh, these are all the plastics now I'm gonna take them out and uh, try to install them on that bike and see exactly how bad they are because um, this is the best price that I could find and they're definitely cheaper than the OEM. Everything is individually wrapped which is nice because um, they don't get scratched in the bag. What you get is the rear fender, the left and right of the um, tank does not have any stickers but they send you a service stickers on the side. They send you the panels for the back of the motorcycle, the white panels which will fit the um, why the WR because it has a special uh, door that you could open to get the air filter and it will give you the front fender which is stock. First I'm going to install the front fender. There are four bolts that I saved over here. It does not come with any hardware so these spacers you have to take them off your old fender and put them in here. So these are um, spacers that the bolt is going to go through. Let's see how is the hole pattern. Does it fit or what? Okay, so the front fender is in. It fits perfectly. It doesn't rub against the. It doesn't rub against the frame. So uh, front fender absolutely spot on. The rear fender is the one that is the hardest to put on because it has all this uh, overflow ball and electronics and the, re the rear tail light. So I'm gonna put this one on the to see if the, the holes would fit. Also, this motorcycle has a rear rack, so I'm gonna have to add the rear rack before anything else. But that's on the very nice fit so far. Okay, so the rear fender is in. I still have to find uh, and figure out my wiring. Now, this is a street legal kit, so it has more wires than normal, but the plastic itself fitted with no problem whatsoever. All the bolts are uh, fitting in the right place. I wish they would have sent uh, the tabs, the little metal tabs with it. Unfortunately, they didn't. This is a plastic company. This is not a metal company, so they don't have those little tabs. Uh, you're supposed to take them off your old uh, plastics. Unfortunately, my motorcycle didn't have them on the old plastic, so I didn't have them all. I had to put a couple of washers here and there, but uh, that was my problem because I didn't have the uh, right product. The same on this uh, side. This is the exhaust side. Metal tabs. You have to pull them out. Oh wow, mine just flew that way. The side plastics come in a pack. They're packed very nice against each other so they don't scratch over here. And it should fit with no problem whatsoever. I have a rear rack over here, so for me it's a little bit harder to put them on. Uh, but for you it should be a lot easier. As I said, I keep my bolts in place. This particular one fits really nice. Um, I haven't realized how big of a difference is between the old plastics and the new plastics. So that's gonna be something that you gotta buy this door if you wanna have it brand new. Not sure how good it will actually match because this company doesn't offer this door. Uh, but otherwise, everything else fits good except maybe here the angle is a little bit different. But I might have been the same way on my old one, so I can't really, really say. And even though I have a custom tank, these should fit because this custom tank is only customized based on the old tank. So there should be no problems fitting these. Okay, so all the plastics are in. I have absolutely no complaints. Everything fit right. I was missing a couple of these metal tabs. Unfortunately, this plastic kit doesn't come with it, which I knew. But everything else fits perfectly. There's no problem whatsoever. Uh, some of these metal tabs that I had, I had to hammer in place uh, into the little niche because the niche has to be snug, so that's the reason I had to push them a little bit harder in. But everything else seems to be working fine. I, I would highly recommend 
this uh, plastic kit uh, for the money that you pay for it. Uh, no stickers, so if you want to get stickers, you have to buy that separately, but otherwise, no problem whatsoever. Thanks for watching, Vegas Romania account.